All right, so I'm coming through the front entrance here. Comes right in here. Pretty big size living space. Now they've got a wall right here, which I would tear down and open up and make it an open kitchen because you'll see the kitchen size isn't huge, but this wall comes down, you have an open kitchen now. So this hallway here opens up to a side. The backyard is huge, has a massive tree in it. This is the downstairs, and this is an entrance to one of the bedrooms here on the side. If you walk down this hallway here, you've got a bathroom. It's pretty nice. Again, this is another entrance, this little hallway from the living room. You've got this bedroom here, and it actually goes out to a little mud room. Um, you can maybe use it as another room. It's not listed as one. Um, the insulation is not quite as great, and you have to go through this room to get there but it has its own exit as well to the backyard. Let me show that to you real quick. A little porch here out to the back. And there's a little covered area back here too as well. Looks down into the basement. All right, we'll come around here. Closet for this room. Take us back downstairs. The ceiling height's pretty decent down here. I'd say it's maybe like six foot five here, and then it steps up. Um, you've got a utility room here with a bathroom and shower. This room here, this has, a, I would put a wall right here and make this a fourth bedroom, and here's why. Back here you've got your utilities, but you've also got a massive closet space that goes all the way back. So this could be its own bedroom, additional rent. This is the bedroom coming in here downstairs. It's actually listed as a bedroom. Again, closet space. But like I said, if you come here, I would put a wall right here and you'd still have all this space is a little down there stairs area.